welcome to our YouTube channel, channel today. It's all about houses, houses and houses. Earlier in the week, I had to drive down here, um, near my old house actually, to put some medication in for Harvey. And a house come up for sale where I used to ride. I'm like, oh my God, if this is the house, I wanna go and see it. But unfortunately, there's no camera access because we haven't asked the owners. But obviously if we get it, we want to get it quick and it's for cold to buy so we just looked at that house um, the house itself would need decorated but that's like any house for me it needs a lot of work so now we're going back to Platt's greenhouse my house uh, to see what's going on there you know what I mean look like a little bit of wind but oh, this is still solid isn't it even if this was all rubbed down and painted a different colour or Today I've come in the house and I think it's such a waste it's because it's such a big house but mentally I can come in here at the minute because before when I come in I'm like get me out, get me out. This is probably the longest I've lasted in it without saying it. Because it's clearer, you're not looking at loads of everywhere. We're, le we're looking at houses to buy, literally what this is. What this can offer is what we're looking for, <laughs> isn't it really? If there's any ghosts or spirits in the house, make some knocking noise. There he is! These rooms are getting clear now. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with this, it's just me. Look. Yeah, it's just you. That's s. Where that pipe's gone. See, look, there's nothing wrong in here with this wall and stuff. No, as well. Old houses are all solid brick. Yeah, they are. Look, no plaster, no s. Hole. The way I see it with this is carpet and paint. Do you know this act blows my mind? It's still washed up just sitting here. Like where you've just done the off. <laughs> what do you mean? Like there's still body washing shit. Like one day she's just done the off out of there, like left all the body washing shit. If all the windows were like this. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. It is nice. But look yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. All that mould and shit. When you look at here, it's all like this. Yeah. Yeah. It's a hot house when it's on. Like I wanted all decking over there. Hello? I, was oh, I thought you were talking to you, Shay. Sorry. Watch. So out here, my panels, you know all that out here, the patio, I want it all new patio because there are fountains there. Oh, and then we'd go, but the kids always threw stuff in them. I'd want all that redone, maybe a bubble over or something. But this actual garden when it's out and it's all green is so nice. Basically, what I'm saying is, the houses we're looking at is this. Don't knock it down, never. Are you serious? Never knock it down. Look. This room's got all fresh paint, looks like, right? Yeah. And it feels better than everything out there, doesn't it? Just because it's lighter and like fresh paint. I could do all the beams white in here, so it if looks bigger. If everything was white, even if you just paid someone just to paint the whole house white on the inside, everything, and you just came here with a blank canvas, you'd probably feel a lot different about it. Right, oh, that's all the dark. All right, precious. Yeah, because at one point I thought, should I have this hole upstairs for me as my bedroom? Dressing room, lounge room, office room, whatever. I loved all that. Yeah, Don't you like that? Do you know what looked nice? You just painted that wallpaper. Yeah. And that was all white. And then that big room in there. Then you've got room. that big room in there. We know it's massive. We know it's absolutely Do you not feel better every time you walk in here? Wait, well, could you make me feel better? That's just don't have that effect. But what I mean is, the more I come in here, I haven't moaned once and said, I fing hate this house, yeah? So every time you come in, there's less in here, there's less in here, so it becomes more blank. And then, that's what I said, if you just had everything painted white in here. And everything new, I'd have day, to have new bathrooms, there's not even a bathroom, look, come in. If you come in one day, it would just be white and fresh, and then you can look at it and think, right, now what do I do? So you look, this bedroom, like. Get well and it's going to cave through. It might, be careful. Go on, Carl, do it for the views. I mean, look. Fall through the ceiling. What, you reckon maybe start this again? I will, personally. The kids hate this house. Yeah, but I mean, to be clear, I don't want people thinking, oh, look at him, just wanting to move in their house, because... Like, it's not no. about that, because it's about me getting rid of this house. I'm just saying, You think you, it's a waste, don't you? For you, you could decorate it, carpet and then if you wanted to sell it you could sell it then never going to sell it like this but if it was carpeted painted and that how much better would it look 
You want to mark my floor a little bit more? Oh, sorry, my room. This is the before. And to see, I'm actually smiling. I've never smiled in this house. Yeah, because your mental state's better than mine. My mental you're state is better. You're not like emotionally attached to it now, so you can think clearly. I mean, what do you guys think? You've seen me go through it. Leave your views below, tell me what you think. I mean, look at them stables. They used to be filled with my horses. I mean, there might be builders or anything out there. Have you got any ideas? Is there anyone out there who want to do a room for me? Design a room, anyone. I would get anyone in who want to design their room so the whole house is different. Because I can't get my head around it. I mean, send your views below what you think I should do. One thing I hate about moving, look, I've got to sort through all of this and I'm not taking all these bags. I'd rather sort them out now, knowing what I do want and don't want. Otherwise I'm gonna have the same problem of sorting it all out the other end. So I'm gonna see how I get on sorting out what I do and don't want here. It's just a headache. I've just walked around, I don't know where to start. I hate it. So I'm out of the start. Don't know where. <laughs> what box do I start with? But I'll start all in here. our first trip to drop it to my house and I'm going to get a McDonald's now because I'm hungry so I'll see you at Platt Screen. Really, really irritating me this. F***ing agony. The dumbbell rolled off the back of the bench and I was like this on the floor and it went smash straight across my hand and it split in three places. So now is not the day to be trying to move furniture around but that's all casted up. You can't get to that, even though that does hurt, but it's protected its heart. So there's the plasterboard ready to go on the ceilings. The thing is, when I got this house, bought it, there was a doorway there, and this was two rooms. So I knocked this through and covered the door area. For me to move in the house, nothing nothing at all can be the same because of my mental health, how it, it just reminds me looking around of situations and that and I don't like it. But because there was a leak downstairs, you all saw the kitchen. Well, a few weeks ago, there was another leak, a bursted pipe this time, causing damage like this. So, as much as people say, why don't you move in, why don't you move in, I can't move in a house that's like this. And like, this was my bedroom. So it all needs doing, this is how it's been left. From the guy who did it, um, done the fly tip into everything. So it just all needs doing. And when I say to people, they're like, why don't you live in there? Okay, how can I live here like this? But now I've decided I do want to move back in, but I have to do it up. Again, I have to, it's, it's my family home and I need my family home back. This is definitely a project and I want you guys to join me in my project.